Welcome to our digital studio here in Synergy. My name is Stefan Waser, Managing Director of Maurice Lacroix. This year is our first participation to the Watches and Wonder Fair. And we are very proud of this. Maurice Lacroix is a brand known for delivering products of high perceived value. With the products we have prepared for you this week, we would like to start now with the first and most important launch of the year, our Icon Master Grand Date. I'm so glad we have today the spirit of Masterpiece in our signature collection, the Icon. The Icon Master Grand Date truly reflects the mindset of the brand today. Creative, modern, fresh with a touch of coolness, and facing the know-how, the craftsmanship, and the experience of our employees and watchmakers. I'm so proud of our team's accomplishments. Can you tell now our audience how it all started? The original brief was to, to rework the spirit of the gravity. Uh, we wanted to keep the main aesthetic elements of the gravity with escapement visible from the front side and the off-centered indication hours, minutes, and seconds. We re-engineered the entire movement to make it thinner to fit in an icon case. And to add a little twist, we've added uh, the grand date indication to the caliber. I think that's a very useful add-on to the watch indeed. But we all know gravity movement is pretty thick, which is something well compensated and well balanced with this bomb sapphire crystal of the masterpiece case. How did you integrate this additional function to the icon case, known for offering a flat sapphire crystal without being too fat, too bulky in the end? This was another challenge for the construction team. And uh, as you can see on Sophie's screen, we could even integrate the grand date function and remain thinner than the gravity movement. This was possible with a smart solution in the construction process. With the gravity, the gear train is central, and to offer the off-centered indication, we've added a module. For the Icon Master Grand 8, we have skipped the module and directly off-centered the gear train. We could then save some thickness and easily integrate the Grand 8 animation. When the gravity caliber is 9.05 mm thick, the brand new Grand 8 caliber is only 8.40 mm. So we gain 0.65, which makes a clear difference in terms of thickness for a watch. Combined with the flat sapphire crystal of the icon and the 45 mm diameter of the case, this makes very reasonable proportions when on the wrist, right? Yes, I think we did our best to offer the best compromise between diameter and thickness. Now, tell us more about the movement. How do you construct it? And what were the challenges for the team? We have started with some existing elements of the ML234, which is our 16 and a half lines movement of very nice skeleton automatic. We have kept the gear train as well as the automatic assortment, but constructed from scratch all the other elements, like the main plate, the three quarter plate, the anchor bridge, balance bridge, and of course the date mechanism. The additional challenge I gave to the construction team was to reach a perfect symmetry between the main elements of the face. The center of the subdial had to be aligned with the second wheel axis, which is aligned to the center of the balance bridge, itself aligned to the center of the grand date. The objective was to reach a design as slick as possible. Yes, when we look at the watch, I have this feeling of a perfect harmony between the different elements. And I have to admit, the integration of the grand date indication is very well executed. Even for me, used to the masterpiece gravity design. You're right, Stefan. When we started the development of the movement three years ago, we very quickly came to the idea of the, the grand date uh, indication. This was clearly the obvious additional function for this watch. But we also had some space restrictions, and thanks to the team, we found solutions. 
Let's have a talk with uh, Lionel, who actively participated to the development of this watch. Lionel, pourrais-tu nous présenter en quelques mots le mécanisme grande date de cette montre Nous avons deux disques pour l'affichage. Un disque des unités, un disque des dizaines. Pour la correction rapide, nous avons un correcteur qui travaille sur l'extérieur de l'étoile entraîneuse. Pour que le mouvement actionne l'étoile entraîneuse, nous avons un doigt flexible. L'étoile entraîneuse permet de faire tourner simultanément les deux rouages sur lesquels sont fixés les deux disques. Et pourrais-tu nous dire ce qui rend ce mécanisme différent des grandes dates déjà existantes Nous avons agencé les rouages au centre de l'étoile entraîneuse, ce qui nous a permis d'augmenter la taille des guichets et de placer avec harmonie sur le cadran et de gagner en épaisseur. De plus, nous avons utilisé la technologie laser, ce qui nous a permis de simplifier la fabrication et l'assemblage des composants compliqués et ainsi fiabiliser l'assemblage de notre complication. Thank you, Lionel, for the clear explanations. I think the team has done a great job and offered the best of Maurice Lacroix know-how for this watch. To finish with the movement, do you think we could share the experience of assembling this movement with our watchmaker Antoine? Yes, of course. Let's have a look at some steps of the movement assembly. I think that's great. That's pure watchmaking. And that's what I'm very proud about Maurice Lacroix. Being able to offer a wide range of watches from quartz to high-end manufacturing movements under the same umbrella. Now that we've seen the movements table, can you tell us more about the design of the watch? Obviously, it's an icon case, diameter 45 mm, and this first model in steel. I can already tell you, Stefan, that we're going to offer other material to the watch in the future. The upper plate of the movement is grained and colored in blue nicely surrounding the hours and minutes dial, also in blue, featuring an embossed squared pattern. At six, we decided to keep the second indication open with a very small hand with red pointer to see through the deep living mechanism. Between seven and eight, we have the balance wheel hanging from the modern circular bridge. We further opened the movement to discover the escapement wheel and pallets bringing the tic-tac to life. And last but not least, we wanted to offer a special window to the Grand Date, taking its inspiration from the six claw design on the bezel, clear signature of the icon family. And what about the back of the watch? For the decoration of the movement, we wanted to offer a modern and sleek touch to the icon Master Grand Date. We tried to avoid the classic decoration like Côte de Genève or Perlage and decided to go with something more modern and pure. During the production process, each part of the movement is treated with the highest attention, cleaned by hand after machining, sandblasted by pistol blowing bronze powder at very high speed, cleaned in several baths, followed by the final touch with all angles polished by hand to get this mirror effect. The final result is a contemporary decoration, perfectly resonating with the front side of the watch. It's clearly an icon. Wow, what a stunning piece. Who did you have in mind when creating this timepiece? Uh, the brand is known for offering a high perceived value product at a very good price. Uh, and here we're talking about uh, manufacture, brand new in-house movement. So definitely we are targeting a, a younger audience. So the young collectors, but not only, also the, the, the watch aficionados, the, the, the watch fans looking for something different. Uh, for us in sales, it's really great to have such a watch in October to underline again that we at Maurice Lacroix are really creating developing watcher from A to Z. In October, we'll have the watch in the stores, but we show you now something which is available in July.
Icon Automatic Chronograph. That, uh, that's a piece that exists for three years already in the collection, but for the very first time we offer titanium to this piece. So what titanium means, so the watch is going to be lighter. It's a 44 millimeter case, uh, so in stainless steel it's quite heavy, it's, it's a bold watch. By having titanium, we reduce the weight by 50%. We're talking about a 150 gram watch, which wow. is really nothing. Yeah. I, lo I like really, I love this, this color combination. It really matches, it's young, it's fresh, it's cool. Um, in the description you have said it's, it's titanium grade five. What does it mean? Yeah, in the titanium we have different quality uh, criteria from one to five and we just decided to offer the best to our customers. Watch is available in July. I'm really looking forward, especially uh, the perfect timepiece for the summer season. Um, really, you have to feel it. It's, it's, it's really, it's so comfortable. But now the next highlight is a watch which is based on a success story of last year. So can you tell us what it is? Yeah, last year we introduced the, the bronze, the bronze case to the Icon Venture family. And indeed, Marcel, the, the watch was a huge success. And we decided to continue this story by offering a dark gray dial combined with the, the black ceramic uh, rotating bezel as a set, uh, including two straps, one black rubber strap and one very nice uh, vintage uh, leather strap. A yeah, beautiful combination, the vintage strap matching with the dial, the rubber with the ceramic bezel. Um, what else is different except the, the colors or are the features the same? Nothing. We keep all the technical uh, features of the Icon Venture range. So it's a watch that is water, water resistant to 300 meters. We have the one direction rotating bezel, 120 clicks. Uh, and the, the, the case back is uh, in steel and not in bronze because we want to avoid any uh, skin allergy uh, due to the bronze material. Beautiful combination and a, a great watch available in June. I'm looking forward to get this. And now you mentioned you have a new size. Indeed. Uh, tell us. I mean, we, we, we like to say that uh, Maurice Lacroix is a consumer centric brand. We, so we listened to the market, uh, to the feedback of our customers and our business partners. And now we offer a new size to the Icon Venture. Icon Ventura 38 mm. So for the very first time uh, in this new size, five mm less than the Icon Ventura we all know for the last two years. Here we play with different shades of white depending on, on the surface. We have the white uh, for the rubber strap, we have the white for the very nice uh, sunbrushed dial, also featuring eight diamonds, which makes 0.1 carat in total. And finally, we have the white on the rotating ceramic bezel. Beautiful color combination, ready for the summer, really fresh, it's really cool. Uh, now from 43 to 38, what was, what was the biggest challenge to reduce the size? The difficulty when you want to develop a, a smaller size of something already existing is that, I mean, you have somehow, you have to adapt to the new size. It's not like just making the things smaller. Uh, you have to fine tune some little details to really fit to the new size. And that was the, the, the exercise we've done the last 12 months. I'm really looking forward to get this watch available in June as a set. So it comes as a strap set with bracelet and, and uh, rubber, white rubber in a specific white box. And yeah, great piece. Thank you very much for this. So the last highlight is not in the Icon collection, it's in the Pontus family.
Yes, indeed. Uh, as you know, we have celebrated the 20th anniversary of the Pontos collection last year, and one color was missing, the blue. So now we have it on the Pontos uh, chronograph, also with the Arabic numerals. And I think this was uh, missing in our collection, and we can introduce it in a couple of weeks uh, in the market. If we look at the five models that we've launched during Watches and Wonders 21, so we have introduced new materials with bronze and with titanium. We have developed a new size for the Icon Venture. We have extended the Pontos chronograph family. And we have this brand new manufactured movement with the Icon Master Ground Date. So I think it's a great achievement for the brand and looking forward to seeing the, the watches in the market. A beautiful collection, beautiful timepieces. We hope we can show you and see you and present you those watches soon and thank you for attending our presentation.